Got a minute? Hi, I'm Yvonne Perry, Artistic Associate at Capital Repertory Theater in Albany, New York. Are you looking for ways to keep yourself busy and viable during this downtime? How about refreshing your actor resume? When is the last time you took a look at your resume? I mean, really, really took a look at it. I mean, sure, format is important, but I'm going to assume that you've got a handle on all that. And now is the perfect time to update your resume. That means getting rid of all those old credits that aren't maybe representing you so well anymore. But here's a tip you might not know. You should have three, yes, at least three resumes on your computer. First, you should have a resume for all those theater auditions, and that resume should have all of your theater credits listed first. And you should have a resume for television auditions with, you guessed it, your TV credits listed first. And that third resume, well, when that indie comes to town and that movie's got a role in it you're perfect for, if you would like to submit, you should submit the resume with your film credits listed first. Bonus tip, whatever you label your resume on when you store it on your computer, you should have that label contain your number one marketing tool, your name, <laughs> because it's all about making it easier for casting to get the information about you that they need so that they can fall in love with you and think how amazing and organized you are and cast you in that role. You don't need a pandemic to sharpen some of the tools in your actor toolbox. If you want a job on Netflix, maybe turn off Netflix and work on brushing up your marketing materials. Meanwhile, happy social distancing. I'm Yvonne Perry. See you next time.